Um, I was taking shots all night and I decided to make the dumb decision to get into my car and drive. She also admitted that the officer You made No, her you stupid ass. ass. You made a real dumb decision to talk about it online. She admitted that the officer never asked her out. That was just a lie for social media attention. Regardless, Skyler confessed and admitted to everything. Oh, goofy ass. Oh my god. What is that? Mm -hmm. What? Did we just become best friends? Yep. Okay. Oh. My stomach in my head. I thought I told you to turn that thing off. Yes. Stop. Hey, yo! What's happening, everybody? It's your boy. C.W. Davis, the popular comedy, and I'm here with my road dog, Gingerbread Me, yeah, 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 yeah. and his little brother, Little Beer, Little Beer, Little Beer, and the new homie right behind me, <laughs> Joker, yeah, the clown prince of crime, all the way from Gotham City. <laughs> What up, y'all? Oh my god, I know. Way too much of an intro. Whew, I'm out of breath. What up? Everybody in here, smoking, drinking, chilling. I hope you having a good time. I hope you was having a great weekend so far and anything. You know how this thing go. Yo, we are here once again for part number four. Y'all been running up the numbers on these videos, y'all. Y'all making me feel so good. Oh my God, I'm like about to be famous off YouTube. No, I'm not playing. <laughs> oh my God. But still, yo, it is so cool to watch this shit. Yo, last time, oh my God. Last, look, y'all see what happened in part three. Look at this. Morgan's counter blessings and leave. Yo, you better. Listen, oh my God. Yeah, yeah. Well, you need to look and that I, up. And I go to Calvary Chapel. You need to. Right. That's concerning. Yeah. Yeah, very concerning. Yeah, we'll talk to Pastor Doug. I, I will. Actually. Wow. Of course. Not. She literally said she was a Christian. And thank God for Donald Trump. And what do all of us say? He ain't the president no more. Stupid. Ah. <laughs> Oh, and she brought the pastor into it too. Oh, you can go ask the pastor. I'm not really like this. Why the fuck you doing it now? <laughs> oh, dumbass. You stupid ass. Anyway, um, yo, we gonna dive into this part four because we got some new shit coming. Oh my god, I hope y'all ready. Strap in, buckle up, get your drinks, get your get your bowls and, and blunts and all kinds of stuff, whatever you're gonna do. And we gonna dive into this thing like some good vagina this young karen who couldn't keep her mouth shut and faced all the consequences she deserved mm -mm. the dui got let off with a warning <laughs> skyler was pulled over after an officer saw her weaving around the road in a way that suggested she might not have been completely Shit, sober are you but according serious? to her video she claims that using her flirtatious and quick wits she managed to and you told on you get away with a warning i blew a told on herself he let me a warning and gave me his number and said we should meet for coffee or lunch he was hot so i'm getting lunch with him tomorrow if her story is true then the officer would be in serious trouble yeah luckily the officer in question recorded the entire interaction on his body cam and the video tells a completely different story oh dumbass here we go my name's deputy storm in the jersey county sheriff's office i pulled you over because you're weaving a little bit back there where are you coming from um i was coming from my friend's house i actually just got down Okay. So I was like crying and like I'm really sad. Okay. Were you were you on your phone and stuff too? Oh my god. Okay. Well, I'm just concerned that you were weaving because of alcohol, but if you're on your phone, have you been drinking? Or oh my gosh, she playing into this shit hard. Does give Skyler a card with the sheriff department's information on it, but it didn't include his personal number, and it didn't come with an invitation to dinner. Dummy. I know you're having a rough night, so I'm not going to add to that by writing you a ticket or anything. Okay. So I'm just going to give you a warning. It's not a big deal. I just want to make sure you're okay. You were weaving a little bit, and I just want to make sure you're okay to operate the motor vehicle, and I believe you are. 
Um, so my information's right here on the front. The reason I stopped you here is on the back. So wherever you're headed, uh, get there safely. And I'm sorry you're having a bad night. Yeah, I'm just like, I'm just I'm Okay. No, you're, you're fine. Yeah. We'll, oh we'll my go. God, we'll she's a great actress. I just want to make sure you're okay. That's all. Skyler's video doesn't just contain Look at this footage of her laughing and bragging about exploiting this officer's kindness, but also states that she blew a 3.8 on the breathalyzer, ignoring that she wasn't even tested in the first place. The legal limit is only around 0 0.8. Wait a minute. Hold up. Hold, hold up. Wait a minute. Pump your brakes there, baby girl. So you get up online. What really happened was that you fake cried your way out of a ticket. And then you get online and tell everyone that you were drunk. You flirted your way out of a ticket. And now you're going to lunch with the cop tomorrow. Are you really that much of a clout chaser? Are you really that bad of a clout chaser? Oh my God, this is ugly. Drunk, but close to death. As at a level of 4.0, respiratory failure is likely. But this doesn't mean Skylar was lying about being drunk underage. Videos were later discovered of her chugging tequila from the bottle and acting drunk at a party just hours before she was caught driving. After she was confronted with this, Skylar confessed and admitted to everything. Oh, goofy ass. Intoxicated. Um, I was taking shots all night and I decided to make the dumb decision to get into my car and drive. She also admitted that the officer you made no, you stupid ass. ass. You made a real dumb decision to talk about it online. That the officer never asked her out. That was just a lie for social media attention. Regardless of her confession, though, no further action was taken against her or the officer who failed to test her. Unlike this next Karen, who didn't get off nearly as easily. This uh -oh. suspect's public outburst takes place on a plane ready for takeoff. Prior to the footage, oh, she's be been good. asked to leave multiple times due to you her need refusal to leave the plane to unless you wear your mask. Pandemic. Yep. Hello. We're, we're gonna take you off the When she's asked to get grab the bag the and leave, she says I'm ready to go. Totally weird. The suspect has a lot of strange mannerisms and seems to be a cult, motherfucker. That's why. Pay attention to how her expression suddenly changes and how she seems to rapidly experience a wide range of emotions throughout the encounter. <laughs> What were James said? Okay, you have a drug. Just like Jesus, motherfucking Christ. You need to call. No, no, I'm gonna do oh, what no. I need to do. I'm gonna say what I need to do. And if you, you're gonna do whatever you feel you need okay. to do to me, right? So I'm gonna say what I am meant to say. Yes, no, to everybody. Stand up, man. Yeah, everybody is you're doing this. You're gonna get arrested if you do not I'm stop. I'm already gonna get arrested. Gonna... The police warn the suspects that if she doesn't cooperate, they'll get have your, to put their hands get on your her. Get your high her ass up is dramatic she also latches onto a supposed promise one of the officers made that she wouldn't be arrested yo, if she gets off the plane i can't yo, i can't they're gonna deplane the aircraft get your high ass off the plane and you're going to jail it won't happen if you get up and walk out with me right now but if you're not going to that's how it's gonna work you're gonna get arrested you can't do that 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 Nobody gives a shit. <laughs> under arrest. We're not her healing. reaction is childlike. She cries in an unconvincing oh way and God. seems to feel that the experience has violated her human rights. Listen to her describe her actions. The way she seems to think she acted is far from the truth, but it's hard to say whether she's deliberately lying or there's Take something more to Take your goofy ass off the plane. Come with me. Come with me. The 
suspect continuously switches between claims of being victimized and anger towards the cops. She seems to feel that she's been personally wronged and that one of the cops lied to her to get her to comply. She accuses this cop of not wearing a mask himself. All you gotta do is put a mask on. He's not wearing a mask though. Once again, we see a case where the person being oh arrested decides to single out a particular officer to blame for everything. The suspect oh refuses my God. to cooperate with a particular cop, but says they're not wearing their mask. But with hey, other members of the <laughs> bitch, we ain't flying. All right, I, you I step would up? not Are you gonna comply you, with no, everybody? No, with you two, yes, not with you, because you're a liar. Okay. Towards the end of the arrest, she repeatedly says things that. <laughs> out of nowhere including not with you because you're a liar a nurse there to check on you're her a liar attracted to the officer she has an issue with her unpredictable I mood and eyeball. irrational <laughs> reactions continue <laughs> Ends with her saying that the fact that she can't relax is the fault of law enforcement. Seems like there are some psychiatric issues at play here, though. Without a professional opinion, it's hard to say for sure. Oh, yo, what the fuck, y'all? <laughs> yo, y'all, this shit right here was another. What was wrong with Shorty at the end? You, nah, that was a special type of drug. That was special type of drug. And then you just kept saying, oh, no, you're a liar. I'm not going to talk to you, but the rest of y'all fuck with y'all. But you're a liar. I'm not going to talk to you. <laughs> oh, my God. Like I said, yo, we live in America, and you're not privileged all the way. You just can't do everything you feel like you want to do. And when you try to wear your privilege on your chest like that, that's that's just ugly. But then it's even stupid. It, oh my God, it's even what? Yo, I don't even know how to say this the right way. Hold on. Figure it out. It's even dumber. When your ass got away with not having a ticket and you get online for clout and tell on yourself. Not only did you tell on yourself, but you want to add on to the lie to say that you were gonna have lunch with the cop and got his phone number. Like, like you, like you the end all to be all, like you the baddest female out here. Sorry, boo boo. I actually, when I saw the picture of you, I thought you ain't had no front teeth with this. I thought you was missing these parts. <laughs> I am C.W. Davis right here, the Papa Bear comedy. That is my road dog, Gingerbread Me. And his little brother, Little Bear, Little Bear, Little Bear, with the OG, <laughs> Joker, the Clown Prince of Crime. <laughs> Yo. Come back again. We're going to have a... Yo, if you really like what's going on, let me know. Let me know, for real. I don't care how y'all feel. Comment. Do what you want to do. Like, yo, this, somebody said in the other video I talk too much. Don't give a fuck. I'm a, a reaction channel. You are going to see a reaction and get a reaction from me. If you want to watch the original, the link is in the description. Go ahead. Watch the whole thing. It's a long-ass video. <laughs> Yo, hi, MCW Davis. I'll be back again, baby. Bye-bye.